going live, so we will be on YouTube. I always tell everybody. <laughs> they behave. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pardon? Can you what? A good lung. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do some filing while you're back there, would you? <laughs> There's a bit of work to do. Yeah. It's all safe, but we'll just stay home by himself. So. Uh oh. <laughs> I had that ability, right? And then that was yeah. the end of that. And uh, it went for a year. Uh -oh. but, uh, hey, uh oh. Hold. Uh, we <laughs> suck it in. Got to change this. You got to show up first next time. <laughs> yeah, you show up first. Yeah. Exactly. That's how you do it. Super smart. Here, pass the first mm. three more here. Are these packages? Yeah. Yeah. Just here. That's for you guys. <clears throat> I never had this big of an audience. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it must be getting pretty interesting. It must be, eh? Don't play with my cat. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even do anything. He gets the pen out of the thing, he gets it going. <laughs> then paint. Yeah. Pretty many. Swear, Jer. This ain't my normal chair. <laughs> what time do you, does anybody have? 6.56. Yeah. 6.56. You can have a copy of these if you want, just to follow Four minutes through. And have a I have an extra one here. Very live, very, started live really early. <laughs> <laughs> At least I'm on time with yeah. no glitches. Today. You're not panicked. So I'm that's not good panicked. News. Well, the glitch wasn't on your end the last time, anyways. No. And you just left. You just left here. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Coming back at Yes. Your clothes. Yes. <laughs> and easy suppers. Yeah. It's like, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys get rained out this afternoon? We got 40 minutes of rain. We just played up uh, in the rain. And did pass up a uh, shelter. Some kids stayed in the water. Well, as long as it's not thundery. Yeah. It's a wide step. So I will give this for. I will need to <laughs> ramp up in the point. I get okay. <laughs> guys, it wasn't a wide step. Whenever uh, seven o'clock hits, then rest of you can start. Good. I get to see it. No, I know. I'll be out since neither of our signatures are legible. Yeah. <laughs> Moved by I one know. scribble, seconded by the second <laughs> scribble. By doctor. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> doctor Gordon. Doctor <laughs> I did not make enough money to call me doctor. Holy bathroom is hyphenated. Christian feathers. I'm like, just pick one. Like, I don't even care what one. She <laughs> signs every single letter. So, like, you go to the bank and you sign for like a loan or whatever. And I'm like, super ADD, right? I'm like, like, let me out. And she's like, every letter. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. Me. I'm like, oh, my. God. We only need 32 signatures yeah. from it. Oh, God. <laughs> Push the wrong button. <laughs> I'm having a hard time seeing Jessica. That's okay. <laughs> no, I know it's okay, but there. 
Getting close. Getting close. Fifty nine. Okay. to go all right moved by jason second by steve that the recreation and fitness committee meeting be open at 7 p.m on favor carried you got to follow your agenda mr chair it's <laughs> of the minutes from the meeting on june 6 2022 is there any Questions about the minutes or corrections? Nope. Everything's good. All right. Moved by Jessica, second by Lee's, that the minutes of the Recreation and Fitness Committee meeting held on Janu June 6th, 2022, be adopted as circulated. Moved by, by Steve. Steve. Oh. Well, there's scribble. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Sure, we'll do that. <laughs> you just want to sign the minutes, please. All in favor? Carried. We're going to move to business arising from the minutes. We have. Discussions from the Canada Day, I guess. We could is that just the on in the agenda. Uh, there was a report from the um, Canada Day financials. Yeah, um, we stayed on on budget. We're actually under budget, so oh, great. Um, that was good. Yeah, it was a great uh, great day. Yes, even with the rain. Even with the rain, everybody loved it. <laughs> question do we receive any funding for the Canada Day stuff uh by the time they announced the funding uh, I did not have a chance to apply for it uh the funding is usually 1500 so um had it been fireworks yeah yeah and it's uh put towards certain things so scrub it chair um so no I didn't Fair enough. I guess there's no other minutes or business from the minutes. Public presentations. Do we have any tonight? Number four. Me. Hello. Hello. Going to start going on. Yeah, just okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just uh, okay. the very first public presentation. So. Oh, we have that. <laughs> um, Leah, name is Leah McKenzie. I just moved here from South River, and um, my kids are. 10 and 13 this year. And I've been going to North Bay and I'm trying to find something closer to home for sports for my kids. So that's basically what I'm going to try to do here with you guys permission, basically. And I want to start with soccer, which is a four week every Wednesdays, like basically a pickup soccer. So the kids can come any ages and we'll just kind of play pickup soccer to start and then we can work ourselves into something more. Great. So you said four weeks. Yeah, every be, Wednesday. Every Wednesday. I'm hoping for the month of August, and then every Wednesday for the month of August. So this be something for the kids to come to from seven o'clock to eight thirty. Seven to eight thirty. Is that really all ages? Really all ages. Is my four year old would be? Oh yeah, honestly, on top I, of that. <laughs> yeah, I mean all ages. Like there's a nice big field right over there. That yeah. We play on every yes, weekend. Yeah. And we can. I'm not sure if I can probably bring my hockey. <laughs> we do have. Um, soccer balls uh we have cones yeah pylons stuff like, like that half fields or something something you can like quarter fields for 
smaller children. We do have uh, a line making machine. We have the small nets too. Yeah, we have the small nets. Little, yeah. So basically we have everything. Okay. So I was just wondering like if you guys were okay if I were to use your field. <laughs> yeah, <absolutely. laughs> yeah. Is there anything we need problem. to uh, advise public works? Is the field ready to go? The, the field basically is ready to go. Um, if uh, you wanted to make lines and stuff like that, I think we have to purchase the, the chalk or the lime or pylons. pylons. Um, At least so for the first summer. See first how summer, see how many people come. Up. The yeah, only yeah. question I have for, since I'm using public property, would there need to be waivers signed? We never did before. Okay. We used to have a soccer clinic okay. uh, pre-COVID, and we didn't do it in uh, 2020 or 2021 for that reason. Mm -hmm. um, and lack of volunteers basically is what we were starting to mm -hmm. run into. Okay. And we had, I know you helped, we had uh, 15 kids. Because yeah. we had two Wrong. sessions. We had like early ages, say from 9 to 10. And then the older ones from 10 to 11, just because we had a bigger group. Okay. But if you want to do the, um, like the all ages, then... Yeah, because even if it was something like the older kids want to come out, we can always play after 8.30 mm -hmm. and stay later. My kids play with me, so. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> they will great. stay. <laughs> we did a T-ball clinic uh, right before uh, COVID as well. Okay. And June and July, it was packed. And August, it like. Dropped off. That's why Very I much concerned. to the point where we almost didn't like run stuff that night. Like we went from having like 25 kids most nights to three or four. Okay. So if, if you try August and, so and it doesn't work, thinking, don't don't get discouraged. Like oh no, that's why we're just seeing just like interest, time. maybe even starting so people know that we're going to try again next year for July. I missed this year. I wasn't. I didn't. I just signed up soccer in North Bay, so we've been mm -hmm. doing that Tuesdays and Thursday nights. So I really want to do something closer to home. So next year or something. I was thinking July. Um, we did in South River. South River had this program. They paid twenty five bucks. They got a jersey. They got a water bottle, and every night they got freezies. So I wasn't sure if you guys ever had that. Was it free? Was it? Ours uh, was sponsored by yeah. Case Populaire. Okay. Um, so they gave us so much money and that included t-shirts, uh, refreshments. We also had fruits and stuff like that. Okay. But we can do the month of August. Um, I'm sure the committee would agree. Yeah. We can promote sure. it. Yeah. yeah, when's uh, our next flyer? We don't have one till September, but we could do a one page flyer. <laughs> kind of <fine. laughs> and like stickers for water bottles? Yeah. Leanne, yeah. Yeah. if you need funding, just send me a letter. We'll be more than happy to sponsor oh, your okay. soccer Thank you. too. Okay. Thank you. Really good idea. So if you, um, they've agreed that we can send out a uh, flyer to promote it. Okay. So we can do that within the next week or so. Just something very. I did one up. I just needed to know where you want me to. Send email. Like email. Okay, so send me everything, and then okay. uh, we'll look after that, and we'll put it in the mail. Okay. And just uh, put mm -hmm. it on our app, and through Facebook, people can share it. Okay. And uh, hopefully, a lot of kids will show up, and you'll be busy. Yeah. And then we'll yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we'll set you up with our equipment, and that way you'll have that. Perfect. Yeah, and right. we'll observe the printing and the postage costs. So. Oh, okay. Well, I don't mind paying for them. I'm totally okay. With no, no. So, we'll, what uh, you're doing is amazing. Well, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah we'll, we'll, uh, $250 a kid to save <laughs> so, <laughs> so, right. Yeah. No, We're that'd fun. be great. Yeah. Be generous. Leanne, can I get your last name? It's Mackenzie. And Mackenzie. And Macy. Kate, yeah. Yeah. Betty. So if you plan on having any um, trophies or any medals or stuff like that, that's going to be costly. Yes. So... Uh, We'll be more than happy to sponsor the soccer clinic because that we've been doing that since the beginning. Yeah, we all have, kids who participated got like a participation we medal. We have so we just had the fire department come out. The fire department I had hot dogs and I had pop and everything. They brought their water hoses out and it was just a fun day at the ending. And they sprayed them down, like chase them around. <laughs> and water so we still have medals too. We still have. We still, them. yeah. We still do. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Awesome. And a little note so you know. I have been talking to South River. South River for next year, if you guys are interested or thinking um, to do <clears throat> even, or if there's another town with, with soccer or something, they can get together and have like one full day tournament mm -hmm. and just be fun. And mm -hmm. I know Asterville and Calendar, I think, mm -hmm. uh, play against each other. Okay. Um, there may be another town. I don't know if anybody. Um, Maybe Mattawa. 
No, it's not Mattawa. Mm -hmm. It's in there. There's three teams, and they play each other between Astorville and Calendar. So, so we I may... for next year. I can start mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's great. That'd be great. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you have a job. <laughs> yeah. so send you. me the flyer. Thank you so, so much. much. <laughs> I'm a go getter. Yeah, good. That's great. We need, we need people like you. Yes. I know. Even I was thinking the other day, like, what's going to happen to the picnic in ten years? Like, there's no younger generation no. learning to take it over. That's why they're having a hard time at the Golden That's Age. That's why I'm yeah. here. I'm, I'm back with the Red Committee. <laughs> we have to either. <clears throat> Well, anyway, we'll get to it. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> All right. Thanks for uh, coming out. And yes. Mm -hmm. That's great. So you have Stepping my up. email? <laughs> been talking about yes. Yeah, yeah. So send me the flyer and everything, and then we'll uh, go back and forth and get everything yeah. going. Perfect. Good. I'll be done tomorrow. Just say that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're awesome. <laughs> yeah. All right. Are we done with the question? Anybody else? No, I wasn't booked, but can I? Pick sure. <laughs> you go okay, ahead. Golden Age is in deep doo doo. We're not getting new members. We're not keeping old members. Nobody's interested in us whatsoever. Um, we had our supper. We had the sum total of fifty six people at our chicken supper, and I know chicken's never been the biggest draw. But we thought, well, at least, you know, it's a start to see how many people we get. We can't run it on 56 people. We can't, we can't do it. It's the only way our age group has right now of raising money. We don't want to keep running to Lee's and saying, Lee's, we need money. You know, like, that's not the whole idea. We want to be self-sufficient as much as possible. Either it's got to close or we have to get something going that we are capable of doing. Um, the, the meals, because of the building, the meals are very difficult to do for us now. The stairs are deadly between the lower floor and the upper. We pay rent for the lower floor, but when we're ready to do a meal, we have to do up and down those stairs with yeah. roast pans and you name it, up and, up and down. We can't do it. We used to have a lot of husbands. Most of our husbands are gone, unfortunately. Um, our ladies are no longer capable. Half of us have memory problems <laughs> to begin with, you know, and, and it's just, it's getting beyond us. It's a club that's been here for years. I understand that. It was started by wonderful people who were not working. They were younger. They were, you know, 40s. And they could do all of that. We don't have that branch. So, no. so you need to promote your club. Well, yes, but we're promoting. We're trying. And it's, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can come. Just give me a call. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Anybody there? Okay. Doesn't happen. Okay. Nothing. Mm -hmm. No answer. What if, um, seeing that we're sending out a flyer for the soccer, if we use the back of that to promote the golden age? We could, except what are we asking them to join? That's what uh, what like I'm looking for. Yeah. What I'm looking for is maybe some input from you guys. What could we do other? That would be a benefit to the community at the same time because that's what a golden age club is for. I think you need to gear to young children so parents will join. Well, I don't think that's the group we need so much. She needs that group for soccer players. Yeah, but she we needs need the middle age. We're looking for 45 okay. and up that are a little bit freer. I didn't know what golden age meant, to be honest. Oh, okay. I was like, am I old enough? Uh, yes, <laughs> yes, you are. Um, I think that could be part of what the flyer should say. Yeah. What is the golden mm -hmm. age club? Yeah. Maybe some people are like, well, that's, yeah, that's over 60. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. What is something? yeah. like I have what to be retired. It's actually legally, yeah. legally, and in our constitution, it's 45 
Okay. I think maybe that's what we should do. Is I would like to rename the club if I could, because golden age is kind of. Well, maybe you should. That's what you're going to say. Steve, do you feel golden? Maybe it needs a rename. No. What about what about a card name? Yeah. We tried having cards. I mean, what we it was very successful, but then COVID killed it. And now we're still, I mean, they keep saying, oh, the fall, it's going to go boom again. We just get started up. And what are we going to do? You're not but alone. I think everybody, You're not like, alone. Like, like, everybody. like our camps are like this, yeah. other camps are like this. Yeah. Like everybody I talk to that's in like a service industry. Yeah. Or, You're really afraid people, to right? take a leap. I mean, card night, big deal. So, but you, there's a lot of phone calls in, involved and different stuff like that. But that's okay. Mm-hmm. We can do that. If but you, you get the them there and then... You say, oh, sorry. <laughs> well, maybe the next time they're not going to come back. Well, if we picked know? a night and put it on that flyer and started in September when yeah. things start to so, slow down for people. Yeah. I think it's it's consistency, right? Like the yeah. dinners mm-hmm. were busy when I first moved here. Oh. And then COVID hit. And now they're inconsistent because of that stuff. I think once yeah. you get up and going again, I think they, they come back. Was Golden Age doing the Medieval Times Dinner too? No, no that, that was the Lions. Lions. That was okay. the yeah. Lions. And My mom was talking about that the other night. She was mm-hmm. like, have a Medieval Times Dinner. Oh, so, and they, they love it. But yeah. That was the yeah. Lions. Yeah. They just met new friends. So they're yeah. like very excited now to start yeah. doing stuff with their friends. Yeah, and I think that's what you guys need too, to start your activities. But our activities never really stopped. It's just that nobody, but nobody came. knows that. Yeah, but nobody came. But how yeah. are you advertising? Yeah. Because I we don't, don't advertise. I don't hear it. But we don't do anything. We have knitting on Mondays and Wednesdays. There's six of us. And it's during the day, right? It, oh, yeah, this is a well, thing. I, I think it's what we need to do you. is find an activity for uh, after hours, mm-hmm. maybe six o'clock, six. Like your cards. You can have our cards at seven. That's, can, that's, we always had it at seven. I'm, yeah. I'm going to bring it back, but I'm afraid of COVID. Do you guys have dartboards and we have dartboards? We have beautiful pool tables. See, that's we don't the kind have of stuff one. Where, we we have yeah. two men that come on Wednesdays, and, and I didn't know about it, but I would play pool every Wednesday. Yeah, so honestly, I, mean, I would just hey, something to do. Like, hey, and I, I think that's can it. we yeah. open yeah. that? Yeah. Club. I didn't even know that they had yeah, a pool table. Can, can we open that club and say, okay, um, you don't have to be a member to come and play pool? Yeah, do you guys, I, I'm like we don't Those want are, we don't want the. I think what you need to do is to promote the golden age because I don't even know what it's about. I know you guys put dinners on. I know you guys have knitting, but that's during the day. Mm-hmm. I work. Mm-hmm. I can't attend. I would love to attend, yeah. but I can't. Yeah. And you have other activities, but it's not advertised anywhere. Mm-hmm. No. Well, no, because we know normally in the other, when I first started, it was only about our age group, but our, our age group is all gone now. Well, that's why she's you know. So now we have to go yeah, to a younger generate. group, yeah. and we're of an age that we we don't think the way you guys are thinking right now. You're popping up with ideas galore, you know, and yeah, great. But we need somebody to because even if you have, that. because I think you have three or four tables, right? Because when we go do the sea pie, prepare the sea pie, we go downstairs, and I've seen no, there's tables. only two. There's only two and a small one. And are you licensed? So no, them. and that's the other thing we're not interested in. Yeah. Okay. We we yeah. and and that was part of the problem. I don't know. I saw the pop up stairs and <laughs> I'll have a white wine, please. <laughs> no, you won't. Sorry. <laughs> no. It's like a taxi service or like a guy with a van again, like there used to be. It would be easier for that. But it's we would prefer to not to get a liquor license. Yeah. We're beyond dealing with people that are a problem and you know our husbands are pretty you know yeah you get out of here sonny (laughs) you know but to bring in the younger generation even you said like 45 like they don't want to play darts and play pool and have a beer you know what i mean yeah and i guess our attitude is if at 45 you can't come and play a game of pool without having a case of beer Yeah, it's not necessarily about the case of beer, but I think if you're going to try and create that social atmosphere, yeah. like if you look at anybody's home, if they're going to play cards with friends, oh yeah, you're going you're to play, have drinks, right? Yeah. You're going to have a drink, yeah. and it's not, yeah. uh, at least from my perspective, it's not about going there and and staying all night and getting mm-hmm. loaded. Yeah. It's like you know, you're going to have a beer, with maybe two, while you're playing a game pool, and that's like Make that's that's this age group that out. that would do yeah. that, right? Yeah. So yeah. You that's, open your membership up. Yeah, it's just and you can have a pool tournament, yeah. even you know, pool, even if you only dark, have two tables, cards. you can have a, a mini 
pool tournament. Tournament. Yeah. 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 So I think the first thing we should do is promote your club yeah. in the back of the flyer. Mm-hmm. Let everybody know, even though it's the Golden Age Club. Still there. Um, and, Still and maybe start uh, your cards back up in September. Say, say we're we start. need you. And then if COVID <laughs> shuts right. it down again, we'll, we'll start up again as soon mm-hmm. as 45. Okay, now I have yeah. a question. Yeah, I have a question. Now, the existing members, most of us go to bed about nine. <laughs> <laughs> but if you have the younger Who's crowd, going to, well, yeah, if, but then are have, they going to be willing? Well, to that's take something on that's going to be determined as you advertise it, and open it. be responsible. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. That's, that's, especially if that, there's booths involved. Jeanette, that's license. something that's going to evolve as you advertise the golden age. If it's 45, you're going to start having people coming in. And on your flyer, you should you should say what you're about. Mm-hmm. You're about helping the community, uh, what the activities that you do, and what is the membership fee and stuff like that, mm-hmm. you know? So to to have younger people come in and be able to take over your spots mm-hmm. and you guys relax. Yeah, because we, like I said, my, pe- my people, yeah. Uh, uh, I'm 72. <clears throat> Most of them are 85 and up. Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean, you all know them. But you the know. one thing that you, that you have to do consistently is advertise. If you want to send a flyer, I mean, mm-hmm. come and see me. I'll send out the flyers. I'll pay to have the flyers mm-hmm. out just so that it, it's out there because mm-hmm. I have no clue when or what you do. Well, we would have to, our executive would have to sit down and decide which yeah. of the activities we were going to offer. And we're not going to give a list of 10. Well, no, you know, we'll start out with maybe. But two, I mean, once like you the have and once the cars, you, like, once it. you have the younger people coming in, and I'm sure that you're going to have because we have a lot of new, a, a lot of new people in our community okay, yeah. that are, that are willing and able to be able to do these activities. And I think once you're able to get them in, you're going to see a different dynamic Especially for sure. If they hear that them going and paying ten bucks to play pool is going to. That money is going to go into a fund to return back to the yeah, because it's going to go back point. to the kids' summer camp. Exactly, you know, people, people, people are always happy to donate money if they know it's going to a good yeah, cause. Be on the but fight. they're even happier to Mind donate you, money. We have to pay our rent. We yeah, have a big rent bill. But that's part of it. That's part okay, of going back so to the community. That's okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah absolutely. You know, we, we have to, you know. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. People are just happy to pay ten bucks. Like ten bucks is. Right, like yeah. that's nothing. You, you go play, right. right. No. You go play. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> go play a few that's games right. of pool, and it's somewhat organized yeah. with a sheet of Bristol board on the who's playing yeah. when. Well, Good. would you guys organize it? Well, I mean, not you personally, but I mean, would the guys organize it themselves, or would some little old lady have to? Well, that's no, something that's going to be determined once you yeah. get your yeah. younger crowd in there. Yeah, because right? that's like if, if you if you three decide you were going to go and, and play pool, I have no problem. Please go. Right. You know, but do I have to be here? No, no. You, you know, no. once you get the interest well, no, and your guys I mean, in there, they'll form yeah. their group. And they'll then have they a group of guys who'll just come in and play. Okay, we're playing play. every uh, yeah. this week is yeah, yeah. we're yeah. having a little tournament. We're playing. And people will bring their own coffee. Yeah. Oh, and I, have a, I actually have a catering endorsement on my liquor license, so that's never an issue for special events anywhere mm-hmm. in the province. Oh, so. okay. That would be handy. If there was something, yeah, you know, something like that. Well, that's a nice way to start it, right? Because yeah. then we can at we least piggyback off yeah. that. And then if it, if it takes off enough that yeah. it's worth getting the license. Yeah. And... I mean, yeah. if you get, let's say you get 12 people in to play pool mm-hmm. on a night, you might sell a case and a half of beer. Yeah, it's, it's not a big amount. Is it really worth your while and your insurance and everything else? for Because it's, no. it, liquor licenses are free. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. Um, we so have a fridge full of pop and then we sell it at a dollar a can, you know, like that's right. up until now. That's all we ever did at cards. That's it, yeah. so you know, water and pop, and... you know. And and there's an honored can in the fridge and you put your I think the number one it. thing is to get your flyer out there. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. ASAP for sure. And put the interest on there. You that just need a small do... village of people who are like as passionate about this as you who yeah, are well, willing to go yeah. and network. For yeah. the people who that's what we're lacking like to we, our, our people are burned. I think if we just take yeah. a straw poll here, would it be pool, cards, darts? Like if we we're gonna start with something, what would interest this group? Like everything. that you and your well, just do a night where you do everything. 
Dark the cards. Takes one wall, pool takes one wall. Because that's what away. they used yeah, to do. Yeah, it's a different yeah. different yeah. areas. Mm -hmm. We used to have one section that we all played cards. Yeah. Uh, and then the men played game pool. night. Oh, and we have a shuffleboard too. I was yeah. just going to oh, say, do you mine. have a shuffleboard? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so then, I, love night. I think, <laughs> it, day yeah, night. day night. Day that's night. a great idea. Yeah. yeah. And then I think if you did that in September, like if you yeah. just kind of did a September thing, get a feel for it. Yeah. I think we would all promote it. Oh, we'd love very to well. do it if, if if you guys think it's a go away. And then if it started you know. monthly, it would probably even be more frequent than monthly. People would want oh, it. I yeah. Think, yeah. Like even if it was weekly, like yeah, it, it, right. So yeah, so it would be a night out for the people. Thursdays you know? probably not a bad night. Oh, what's what's your time time thoughts? Somebody have to be there seven. with the key. I yeah, think it was seven, 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 to, seven, yes. seven to a, ten or eleven. Seven to ten or eleven. Really, to yeah. ten. Yeah. Seven to yeah. ten. Seven to ten is fine. Yeah. Yeah. Three hours. Seven thirty yeah. to whenever we were done. So yeah. um, some groups, you know, like when we played cards, yeah. the card people were done before or as the same time as the pool. Mm -hmm. And you can do it like we used to do, where. Um, Everybody, we used to bring, uh, it was like a potluck, yeah. basically. Mm -hmm. Somebody brought dessert, some brought, uh, <laughs> you know, and then during yeah. break, we all went and yeah. ate. See, well, and we had, a, we yeah, had an objection to that, to too, because <laughs> most of the older people wanted to leave, but it ended up, we had a 31 group, which was most of us, and then you guys were more of the mm -hmm. card player. Not all, there were mm -hmm. lots of seniors there, too. But we were always stuck having to sit there and wait. No. And clean up. I think you have enough responsible people sitting yeah. around the table that yeah, somebody yeah, would yeah, be Yeah, one, one of you guys would yeah. stay and clean up. You it's just to somebody. make sure that the yeah. door is locked. Yeah. yeah. And that there's yeah, no yeah. dirty dishes or anything right. or, you know, anything like that. Yeah. I also have a suggestion mm -hmm. because the Golden Age Club also does like lots of food stuff. You could also do a night, like say you do this pool card game yeah, on yeah. A Friday. Yeah. Let's say Wednesday night, you could do a baking night. Get people together, teach them how to make the pies for the the sea pie. Uh, but then that could be the food that you eat on the Friday rather yeah, than a potluck. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You can just bring all that food and then it's two birds, one stone. You're yeah. you're networking to a different demographic of people that still would want to join to help out with a different genre of Thing that you offer well we we thought of of kids like teaching them baking mm -hmm. on a saturday yeah whatever that's another you know we, we would like to do that yeah. but i mean you, you when you start looking at the activities that kids are in today are it uh, you know mm, am i going to go and learn how to bake cookies today or am i going to go to this this and this yeah. you yeah. know they're all so busy but I, 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 I think, I think, I think <laughs> Janet, if we give them the choice to do it, an activity to yeah. do, you and might be surprised that doesn't amount. hurt. To you might be surprised at the amount of children that yeah. do want to debate, what if we even if out? like a child and parent, child and mother going uh, and, yeah. and bake. Yeah. Yeah. And if we sent out um, um, a survey. survey, thank you. <laughs> I'm old. A uh, survey. And would, what would you be interested in? Would you be interested in this, this, this? I think, Steve, you, did you do that? Kind of? I, I've gotten away from surveys. I think yeah. very small work. amount of people fill them yeah. And then by the time you get them back and analyze them, you could have ran something. I think oh, you okay. just need to go you with your flyer. Yeah. Yeah. Flyer yeah. first okay. and then flyer and we have the board. Do your game night with every game you could offer. Find a card deck of Uno. It doesn't matter. Anything that you yeah. can find. Most Mostly they like Euchre. You, you know, like, hey, that, yeah. that was yeah. a big draw. Yeah, Euchre fit really filled up. Yeah. Well, I think because we had maybe 20, 25, 24 people. Yeah. Uh, uh, steady. But it's like we had a date night. Yeah. I think offline. Why don't we actually just try and find a date that works at least for all of us, and then we can go about our people and promote. And I, I'll bring friends that aren't even from town for that kind yeah. of stuff, right? Yeah, and, yeah. Um, like so, why don't we find a date that works kind of for all of us and our spouses, and then it's something to do, and you guys obviously as well. And and then I think what you're going to see from there is organically, if you allow, if you say. We want you guys to use our space. Yeah. Because what we don't have is space. What, yeah. What you have is space. Yeah. So it's like, I think there can be a, a great relationship yeah. where there's like, okay, well, we'll figure out what yeah, we want to do. Start a pool and we'll figure like out how to make it a bit revenue generating for you. And, and that's a little note <clears throat> yeah. if people are kids. 
Is there another room that you can put a movie on for them? Oh, we can yeah. go on the stage with a projector. Uh, no, we can't have upstairs. Oh, we no. only own just downstairs. Down. Down. Just the downstairs. Downstairs. That's the We're catch. Downstairs. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. Does there have to be an I mean, we could make a deal. We do. I don't know. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, When we join the stage, like, does there have to be? No, listen, her daughter, 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 my daughter used to come with you know, me all the time. She had a great yeah. time. She would play euchre. Didn't she? How she played thirty one? I don't know. Oh, right. Yeah. I think yeah. it would be smart to open up those nights to anybody above the age of yeah. eighteen because then you have young, strong people to help you carry the big ass pots and to do all of the yeah. things that you need. Yeah. Well, we even if you don't want yeah. them to do like yeah, yeah, yeah. But just for the activities, the activities. What I mean, I don't want to put 18 and then tell little kids you can't come because you're not 18 and you're not going to bake. I would rather you know? tell a small child they couldn't come than somebody who's 42 that they yeah. But if we're, if we're going to set up like baking lessons, it's going to be for an age group. And that's the you thing know? you don't yeah. need members to participate in the in the activities, right? Like, or is that? Well, usually there's rules? members there. Somebody has to have a key. And there's oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. But, but, but I, don't, I don't have to be a member to go play cards there on that night, right? Definitely so that's the not. thing where it's I like, mean, we will bug you. Oh, I, I hope you do. Yeah. I hope you do. Okay. And, I mean, it's a grand sum total yes. right now of $10. So in order to be a member, you have to be so. 45. But in order to participate in any yeah, of the activities. I mean, for 10 bucks. Yeah, you don't have to be. Right? Like, so, do you remember yeah. when they used to have the game nights and the movie nights? Yes. Oh, oh, yes. Yep. I yes. used to run those, eh? I guess. That was, I went, that was the recreation I committee. Yeah. yeah, I went constantly. And it yeah. was what I looked forward that to the most. That stuff is still available, isn't it, Andre? Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. We um, again, like I'm saying, most of our age group doesn't want to be out at night. Right. Okay. So that's, but that was for younger kids. That wasn't it, very late, was it? Was it? I think that was nine nine thirty. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it was on a Friday. Yeah. yeah. Um, but it was one night people was in the PJs at seven. So yeah. That's, but anyways, if yeah. younger people will will be joining, yeah. so they they can look at that. So you need to get somebody to okay. do a flyer. Okay. Let's do a flyer. Like just the wording of what you want in there what you want people to know about your club yeah i'll come and see <laughs> <laughs> and then anyone she's a worker i'm the a activities. lousy worker yeah. <laughs> i think the flyer should just say yeah how quickly do you need it because we can probably pick a date like if we're looking in september i think we just oh, pick, pick a, a date pick a September. Yes, let's do it on the 15th means. and then i'll bring my wife it's our anniversary no oh, i'm just kidding no oh, do it on the 15th i'm joking you're cheating <laughs> yeah i'm kidding <laughs> But, it was your 15th. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 It was a surprise party for your anniversary. Yeah. 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 Let's put banners up. Yeah. Yeah. But I think we just pick a, like, okay. let's do a day now and then yeah. we can put it in the flyer. And, yeah. And it's great starting. Yeah. yeah. When, what the, weekday works better for you guys? We used to. We used to do Thursday nights. Thursdays. Yeah. I like Thursdays. Yeah. Thursdays seem to be a little over the hump. But yeah. And if you yeah, go to work a little bit tired weekend. on Friday because you stayed up till 11, well, so, so what? Yeah, right? it's you can Friday. go home, start over again Friday night. <laughs> right. Um, the well, 22nd I'm, or 29th of September. Thursdays. First and second week of September, everybody's pretty crazy. I was going to say, do you know what school is? School's yeah, yeah. School, that's not good. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> the 22nd or the 29th? Is that what you said? 22nd. Do the 22nd, 22nd and then you can try again the 29th if they like it. Yeah. Yeah. And then you can for sure plan for two. And if it doesn't work, then you have the next month you can start fresh with new ideas. Yeah. That's so great. we're going to have pool and we're going to have cards and uh, darts. And shuffleboard. shuffleboard. And I think that's good for now because I think would, if you start yeah, getting too many things, yeah. all of a sudden everything you got you so many guys doing people. this, you yeah. don't have enough guys doing well, whatever. Yeah. You know what? We can lots. accommodate those those four. Perfect. You can't any you can't add any more, and we'd have to subtract one. But yeah, that's, 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 that's perfect. Yeah, perfect. perfect. Yep. Start time. Seven. 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 Seven to ten. So is seven to ten yeah. okay or is seven that to seven, seven to ten is fine? I think seven to I wouldn't want to make it and if yeah. people leave at nine, they leave at nine. I mean just oh, well, yeah. I mean, yeah. Sooner. yeah, exactly. Yeah. The cards usually ended up between nine and nine thirty. Nine thirty, depending. Yeah. yeah. Depending how many people how many. No. 
talk. That's the thing. There's gonna like there hasn't been anything for anybody to really get together and just like (laughs) chit chat. Yeah. Yeah. Like I think and and some people play slower. Like I'm talking about euchre. Some people play slower than others. So one one game, uh, one table would be finished and waiting for. Because the way it worked is uh, we had four or five tables rotation. and then rotation. Okay. The winners would move to the next table and okay, the losers yeah, yeah. stayed there or something like that. So if that table happened to talk a lot and they got slow, then that table would have to wait for them to. Uh, but 9, 9.30 was usually mm-hmm. when we finished. And yeah. we started at 7.30, not 7. When we played euchre. Yeah, so we used to yeah. start at 7 because we had to be yeah. there anyway. Yeah. 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 Seven to 10 euchre sense. started yeah. at 7.30. Yeah. So it's like two hours. Yeah. yeah. So if we start at yeah. 7 by 9, 9.30, you're done. And yeah. then. But we'll put it at 7 to 10, say, just to cover, you know, whatever. Absolutely. And uh, I mean, you're not kept there till 10 by any means. And then that night you can, you can have uh, little flyers handy promoting with the Golden Age Club to become a member. And do, um, from a catering perspective, is that a night that you would be able to lend your license? And I can do it anytime. Yeah, okay. And I'm sure we can find uh, people with smart service, uh, volunteers, you, smart, yeah. Do they expire? No. Yes. They do. Oh, yeah. oh they do now? I, okay. have it I have, I just got mine, so. Yeah. so I have one. Well, this was, yeah. well, we, when did that change? Probably. Just it's probably expired. <laughs> so does another, that mean just another money grab? Fee. Yeah. Another so fee. So I got mine. Well, a couple, 2019. Couple years ago? Yeah. 2019. Did people get grandfathered so did, in. I don't know if they did or no. not. No. So. Well, yes. I'm not really <laughs> <really young. laughs> How long did it last for? So I got mine in my Well, mine. They said it never <laughs> renewed. You had it for life. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm glad you don't. It's it's just happened within <laughs> just this year. Yeah, we okay. were that a couple of years ago, and they said anybody from 2012, I think. I can go through my emails and send. Yeah. So we're grand from two. We'd have to look because we got ours in 2019, You're and I'm probably pretty sure ours 2019? was for life. Yeah. When we did it, how do you? Try? But if they want to expire mine, they're more than happy. Car when they get home. <laughs> Anyways, I'm not going to answer before I was even legally allowed to drink. I think. <laughs> you know, if it expires, it'll have an expiry on your card. Okay, so we're going to call this a date night. Date we'll night. also have to okay. put on the flyer That'd be what good. the, that would the be fine. prices to get in. But if so you're single, you're still allowed to come. See, this oh, yeah, is another yeah. thing. Okay. I'll just have date to make night. sure. Yeah, yeah. We never tried it. Or anybody. find a date night. One of the whatever. <laughs> no, if you're going single, maybe you won't go home single. <laughs> but I think what's going to happen okay. is and and they should was, form a committee you know, for this so, activity so that yes. they organize stuff. Yeah, just yeah. to have something. That would be a good plan. Mm-hmm. A little uh, a little committee. A little to, committee just to organize this night. So we just don't. <laughs> I hear the chair. Yeah. Appreciate that. I will uh, volunteer on the committee you're chairing. That's wonderful. All right. <laughs> I didn't say that. You did. I say that. You should be quiet. I'm only 34. Okay. Well, we can see how the first night yeah. goes, and then, like you said, yeah. form a committee yeah. to plan. Uh, yeah, just with the golden age to yeah. play, plan up. Because yeah. we'll have, if we're going to use Lisa's license, then we have to uh, put a price yeah, on the booze that ice. You need a little. You need yeah. something. You need a little bit of organization. You need a little community there, just so to people get an go idea ahead. Yeah. 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 Oh, really? Yeah. Now, I don't have anything oh, that even remotely looks like a bar. I don't even know where right. mine is. I did it so long. Do you, you have a bar? Good. Is it rolling? Can you take it to the pool room and over to the car? Yeah. 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 I'll tell you downstairs for you. We can fix that. <laughs> She's talking to cooler, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Don't draw it. Yeah. I got one of those. <laughs> we all have a bar then. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because we need coolers with ice. <laughs> yeah. I have yeah. one I have, fridge I have and it's full of pop. Of those types of things. <laughs> lots and lots. Okay. Yeah. We have pop and water that's a dollar each, so you don't have to worry. Yeah, there's no expiration. You can do that. 
So if there's mm -hmm. no expiration there's no date, expiration you're good. Date. It doesn't expire. The new ones have a date on it. <laughs> I guess who's working the bar that night? I can just get up and it's fine. Well, that's right. I lost my card. Yeah, I think it's awesome. Why would you look for it? And it's on YouTube. I just remember that. <laughs> you can't even deny it. Mine expired. <laughs> okay, so. Um, uh, okay. When are we meeting people to, to make this happen? Chair. What? Chair, chair. <laughs> <laughs> we can set up another meeting. Yeah. Just that night, no? How just, much is just Chris Bowman told me there. Just do it. <laughs> You're the one who got the trial. Just with the information. Yeah. We, have the, flyer. Flyer. we yeah. have the date. We have the date. We're going to make the flyer uh, to introduce ourselves and just blah, do the blah, first blah. night. And if anybody on the first night's like, this was pretty cool, how can I be a part of this again? Mm -hmm. Then say, like, we're going to do a meeting the same time next whatever day. See why we need young people? It's mm -hmm. got brains. <laughs> Perfect. I don't have it. Sounds good. Right. Okay. Okay. Got out of that one, Amy. Eh? So we'll work together with that. <laughs> You're in it. She gives you the greasy eye. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, people. Awesome. That's going to be great. I'm looking forward to something like that in the community. To be honest, yes. So. I'm so glad because I'm yeah. so tired of my age group and you can't. You can't. No. You can't. You can't. What you bring is the space for us. So yeah. Think, uh, yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. Hey, we'll sublet the whole thing out to you. You just take over. <laughs> we'll just take over. <laughs> well, maybe someday we'll. Yeah. yeah. You never know. You wait. Yeah. We'll see how this goes. We're going to undercut you, though. You're not going to be happy uh, with the price now. <laughs> just out of 10 months in a while, okay? <laughs> Well, thank you, guys. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Can't say no to that. Okay. No. Okay. Perfect. All right. Number five reports waterfront development update. Uh, Andre. The la latest report I received from Anne, we still don't have a date um, on shipping of the equipment. Uh, but as soon as they have that, they're going to let us know so that we can, um, but we can't get in the water until. The 15th anyways, uh, or work around the water. Uh, so after that date, the dock's going to be going in as well. Okay. Um, the curtain is installed. We're just waiting for the... Um, yeah, I've seen that. The, the, not the banner, but the sign uh, acknowledging where the, the grant came from, from OTF and whatever. And then we're going to have a grand opening of the uh, curtains and everything. So um, that's all I have for Anne from me right now. Okay. Looks like they're powered too, eh? Yeah. Because I see wiring to the curtains. So they're maybe... also wind censored. So uh, once they're down, if uh, the wind is too high, they will go back up on their own. I was there uh, on a weekend and it was another young gentleman out there. You know what he told me? We're gonna, I was thinking, well, what if the pucks start, uh, if you're shooting on that side and go over, is that gonna going to be a damage? Target the curtain apparently not apparently not okay Organic. otherwise we could put mesh you know like they have yeah. the arenas they got the black mesh i'm thinking he goes yeah some kids might just whip the puck at that and i went hmm i never thought mm, of that no apparently not uh because he was fully aware that you know it, it is a hot i mean drink. it's three feet from the boards but still <laughs> yeah like is that gonna bend or smash or what goes up and down and then it don't work no more that's well they're they're not um tied they're loose yeah i see the cables there yeah okay so even if a puck hit it they're just gonna they're just kind of uh, yeah. take a little bit of uh yeah okay yeah but and made sure to look into that and as soon as the the if the wind gets too high and they start flapping then they just automatically go up oh cool so so when we do the open house there'll be a demonstration yeah. and everything and have we come with a final plan from where what this like where this pad's gonna go, where the like out here. So out here you have the beach, you have the playground equipment, you have the volleyball court, then you're supposed to have the fitness equipment, and then after that the splash pad. But they're looking into uh, maybe taking the volleyball and moving it further so the splash pad and uh well, fitness equipment because is because if you look at the the way it's set up here i think the pad be closer than further out yeah so Just... they're they're thinking of moving the volleyball um only because the ground is not as oh, saturated yeah. at this end 
So there'd be less of an issue. So they're looking to just maybe move stuff around. So they're, as soon as they start um, okay. getting the ground ready, then that decision will be made. We still got our geese issue to deal with too. Yep. I don't know Don't how we get around swan. that. Put up the they have the swans. They will swans. not go over. <laughs> no, no. They, you can get the mortal and and well, you put on your garden. There are many communities that little bought the, the oh yeah, yeah. yeah. They will not step big. Over that. And you put that across. Mm -hmm. put, well, we'll anchor. You know, with the thing of a stringer and and put them there and. What they do though is yeah. we have string all the way across, <laughs> they come to the beach <laughs> and they go that way. And we used to have dogs that would just yeah, kind yeah, of flop. Yeah. Uh, but what happened is parents were letting the kids play with the dogs and just throwing them. So it did. someone always has to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, but we did have dogs placed yeah, on I there and it was helping the, you know, they would move and the geese would go, mm -hmm. but the kids would play with them and then just throw them. And so that mm -hmm. defeated the purpose. Right. Yeah. Um, the more the water is used because when my kids were growing up, we had no geese issue there because mm -hmm. the, the beach was used like all day long. Mm -hmm. So I think once it starts <laughs> to get used again, um, mm -hmm. We may have less geese because right now they're a lot of the times they're at the other beach. They're taking we have, over, yeah. Yeah. No. So we'll figure it out. I think adult beach volleyball tournament. And I was just going to say, like, like, can I get volleyball? Yeah, yeah. Right? Sure. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're going to bring yeah. your little mobile barn. Well, maybe you can uh, get <laughs> all this going through. You can do all this. Yeah. 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 Thanks for the report, Andre. New business, 6.1 or 0. Yes. We had nothing. We for, have nothing. Nope. Unfinished business, 7.1. 7. Just open the, there's a little um, slash. Summer camp. Uh, we have 45 kids registered. Nice. Um, and uh, everything will be at Camp Keratu. And Steve said we're good with the volunteers that we have and everything. I think so. I think any time we get volunteers, we'll take more, but I think we're like getting pretty close to. Yeah, we're at 45 need. confirmed. Okay. So, um, a little higher. Pardon? We have a waiting list? Then there's no. maybe five more on the waiting list. Oh, that's five, eh? Maybe we'll no. Take those five. What? Um, so. It's 50. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like a really nice round number. Yeah. What's the date on it again? Uh, oh. August 15th to the 19th. What age group do you take, please? 5 to 15, 5 to 16, I think. So, what Not about sure the, the funding for that camp, uh, kids' camp, summer camp? We have. Um, I think we have leftover. Not much. No? Um, but with everything and the um, um, the registration cost uh, kind of breaks out even. Okay. And it's at what, 50 or 75? No. But Our for registration the, cost. For um, families that can't afford it? What's yeah. that thing with them? We only have one family. Okay. Nobody else uh, on the list and... Um, no okay. names were given, so we only have the one family which uh, we've been sponsoring. I've got money for it because I usually give every year, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, but we did that New Year's Eve dance there, and that brought us some funds. So let me know, send me an yeah. email, okay? Because I have funds set aside for that. Okay, Actually, I'll let we did you know pretty well with that. With the New Year's Eve, we did yeah, we that. did, we did. Do your yeah. kids like reptiles? No. But they are signed up. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> no. They'll like reptiles by the end. I hope so. Usually they're close How many more do you need, realistically? No, do you not? No, we need volunteers. No. Have you guys no. tried to no. volunteer and getting some high school students kids were, for their volunteer were hours? Mm -hmm. okay. Does that work? Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> Difficult. Yeah. Really? Uh, Kids are that lazy. 
<laughs> I'll let you know. I don't know that I can three days, you can, but, or four days. Five, you can get people to just sign up for all your hours. Mm-hmm. If you want a kid, mm-hmm. maybe. Really? Yeah, so yeah. I want a kid who don't want to put, like, so, like, like I know I only like, work eight like, hours, but are you really only going to work eight hours? Like, you could say I did, like, 15. That's how it goes a lot of the time now. So, people are not wanting to do, like, on They ask us to do that. Yeah, we won't do it. Yeah. Like, yeah, terrible. I need to have yeah. parents like I spent a lot of time cleaning yeah. the yeah. church for my own. Someone used to call me yeah. at the beginning yeah. of June and say, My son needs volunteer hours. He has to have 40 or he cannot have his diploma. Okay. Uh, okay. What's his name? Did I work with him? Well, no, but he, he needs he needs that piece of paper. So you have to stop. No, I don't. <laughs> and I won't. Yeah. You know, yeah. like, I'm sorry. <clears throat> that's good all right that's it for summer camp yep all righty 7.2 2022 programming halloween santa parade <laughs> halloween's my baby yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's right so i don't really know i think this year i'm gonna look for like a different route around town because i've had a couple people mention that it's long and it is pretty long especially when there's lots of kids and stopping so we'll look for something smaller. I'll need people's input on that. I just wanted to include as many like small parking, like the medical building, they have a little parking lot in the store and then the hall. And like, I just tried to get as many parking areas as I could along the route, but I'm down to make it. This is the third year now. I'm down to make it a little bit it. smaller. I just don't know if people are going to be interested now that COVID's not as big of a factor. I know a lot of people liked that they had to do less work but i know that there's a lot of people who also want to take their kids out like door-to-door trick-or-treating so Renee, I'm kind of... I, I have to tell you the feedback that we've gotten at the case pretty good that <laughs> is excellent yeah people love it they don't have to go door-to-door with yeah. their children they don't have to it's Drive right there and the kids yeah. are having fun they're involved they're, they're dressed safe. up That's they're awesome. safe I had one lady message me last year. She said that they just moved here and her son has cystic fibrosis. And this is the first year that he didn't feel left out on Halloween. Oh, she didn't have to go I pulled awesome. my eyes out for like two hours. Yeah. That's no, awesome yeah. for sure. and this parade, for this yeah. is on Halloween. On the Monday? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Halloween's on the Monday. <laughs> And the people yeah. that want to go door to door, they can do both. Right? Yeah. 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 Now, aren't you doing yeah. the thing at the hall this year too? I, like that's another factor. Like we need to both work around the hall because there's going to be lots of traffic, right? So that's I, a factor. I think so your event basically replaced the one. At it the pretty hall. much. Yeah. 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 Think it, did, yeah. it used to be the uh, yeah, agricultural yeah. society and that put on, and they won't be doing. No, no, no. You won't be stepping on toes because. Richard, who was one of the biggest organizers, him and his sister and the rest of the group, uh, Richard moved and uh, they're having member issues with uh, members, like they don't have enough members. So um, for us to continue what you were doing with the parade and everything, um, and then it's easier on everyone. It's easier on everyone. And if the rest, like they said here, then if they want to go trick or treating door to door, It, yours is still early enough right so uh yeah. it gives the parents the op- the option of doing both for those mm-hmm. who want to now the fire hall before did an open house the year before yeah they COVID. used to do like the haunted house so hopefully they stuff. will still do something and then if you just put it on yeah that was on pretty group, then people can just kind of mm-hmm. join in that you're scared this will end up drawing people to the community it'll be bigger than no, I say, like, especially to get with the change that was, that I had last year was because only people mm-hmm. from this community were donating but there were people from like Mattawa, Powas, and Asherville yeah but it doesn't, it doesn't it'll get so it's I had fine. people like yeah I like is my kid gonna get the same amount of candy as a kid from Norway yeah, and it's yeah. like I'm gonna try my absolute. You can. Yes. When like you're like running through the streets, wow. you know, my hand's only so big. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you're only getting so yeah. much. No, yeah. it's not no. like they were put no. into individual bags. They don't. Know. They don't need to be taught to be greedy. Yeah, yeah. 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 Renee, yeah. you're doing. It's, it's not the kids. It's just there's it's, always like yeah. one person. Yeah. There's yeah. always. Yeah. There will yeah. always be that yes. one person. Yeah. And and you've done an exceptional job with that parade. Like, yes. it starts in July. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
yeah. my daughter's birthday is on the mm-hmm. 19th and on the 20th like it's halloween in my head yeah. Yeah. It's awesome. the mm-hmm. what's, we, what's your usual route i know you go up gano yes yeah, so we did from gano we went down in front of samson's which we can skip that year yeah. that's, that's uh but if you went down church yeah instead he, he lives right the corner so we could go right past his house go down church and then come straight this way by the fire hall I just don't want to take away too many streets that's kind of where and like with floats and stuff like it's hard to do the turns and the big hills yeah and and my grandma walks the whole thing every year and she's not getting any younger (laughs) she reminds me every year so (laughs) so if if you did Ganyo church railway Mm-hmm. Just like the uh, Christmas parade and or the could, um, do you go up and go to the hall or do you want it to come to the township? It could either come here or it could stop at the fire yeah. hall. And if they're doing um, yeah. a haunted house, they could mm-hmm. you could finish off a, like have the kids walk or drive or okay. um, you coming down Young Street? Next, yeah. Yeah. Part, yeah. <laughs> No, not at the fire hall. I was thinking that, but it's no, it's if they're doing door to door, then I'm kind of happy that I started planning this through COVID because there were so many things that I had to keep in mind. I was like over prepared. So now I can kind of like relax a little bit with that. But I'm still nervous about the traffic and having people walking and having kids on the side of the road. And yeah, it's tough. It's, it's a, it's a lot. (laughs) It's a lot. So I'm hoping to get people's input this year on where they want the parade, what was not necessary, like street wise. Because I know with the, when we have the Santa parade or the uh, um, Canada Day parade, they'll line up like all along railway um, by the beach okay. and then they'll park up at the fire hall. There's enough parking on the side there yeah. and um, at the church. And then they just kind of, find spots find spots and yeah. i know like with us we always park at the beginning of gagno we just ask the neighbor if we can park there and he's sure and we just stand there and when the parade's gone like we come out so um there's a lot of places along the way that you can park yeah. like the medical center is another one yeah um how long does it take the parade? kind of depends on how many kids there are ish how many last and how many floats? Last year, oh, was I, I didn't lot. even keep track. I just told, like, I was just so happy that anybody that wanted to be involved, I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> like, it's at this time we're meeting here. Like, <laughs> yeah. It was about an hour. Yeah, I feel like it was probably closer. Because I think it was, it was getting by dark. By the time it, it was getting oh, it was dark, pitch black. Yeah. So yeah. and I was dumping two. like Tupperware containers, big Tupperwares into kids' bags. Like, bring your truck. <laughs> Yeah, Whoa. so I wonder if it's one of those is if we plan the parade route properly, and as long as there's ways to get around, like maybe we can use a couple of municipal vehicles just to help block off streets, mm-hmm. just to keep the kids safe, and yeah. you know, just to yeah, because the last thing we want is we in pitch can black. Do our part. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it was cool having it because I did it an hour later last year or half an hour later because I wanted people, I wanted it a little bit darker. Because a lot of people put mm-hmm. a lot of time in their floats with like lights and oh, stuff yeah. like mm-hmm. that to make it spooky. And the first year you couldn't see that because it was like kind of bright like this sure. when it was done. Um, so I had it go later last year, which I really, really liked. And a lot of people liked it too. Yeah. It was cool seeing the kids like running mm-hmm. in the streets. Absolutely. And caught, like it felt like Halloween again. So I would like to do it later again. But it's like I said, it's scary when it's dark. So let's just keep that conversation. Uh, yeah. going because i think as we get further into the progress i think it would make sense if we talk to public works about okay. and, what and you're do, like doing from, it on a school year this year as before you did school on day, weekends yeah. so yeah. that makes a difference too yeah and you need to Monday mm-hmm. night, so. yeah so you need to allow time for your your parents to get home, get yes. home have supper dress yeah. and then i think it started at 5 30 last year which was a good time because the whole day and the morning of the parade I'm like in my dad's garage with 15 family members going through all the candy, making sure nothing's open, nothing's been tampered with, everything is organized, everybody has specific buckets. Like it's like it's a big production. Mm-hmm. So having a start at that time was good. I think that gives parents enough time to get their kids. Like, it's just that it's a weeknight. Parents work till five. Mm-hmm. Um yeah it's it's going to be really tight for the parents they're going to be six running would be 
And I know kids yeah. are probably and super anxious most, to get going, but I yeah. think that and most of them are working in North Bay, yeah. so or right. Mattawa. So it takes them 20 minutes to get here. So if it starts at 5 30. Okay. I think they can make six o'clock work. Yeah. They'll have to adjust dinner or do whatever, but whatever. Candy for dinner. Right? <laughs> yeah, okay. Six o'clock Monday. That's you're the wrong you can do it on, on Sunday you can do it on Sunday do it on the weekend you have that no. option no. <laughs> no. I mean, you could. it's Halloween it's yeah. I'm not I'm not dressing my kid up in the whole costume <laughs> twice two yeah. days in a row because then parents take still have to take their kids out on Halloween yeah. you're like oh never yeah. mind yeah and then the next day you're gonna actually have to pull yeah, yeah, yeah. too yeah yeah Okay, so you'll you'll keep coming to our meetings and corresponding with us so yep. that we can continue working with you okay. and let us know uh, when to start promoting like the candy donations and stuff like that. I because, usually start that in August. Okay. But it sounds like there's going to be lots of stuff starting in August. So we're but to get to... to start getting the word out, mm -hmm. um, so we you and I can uh, work with that just so that we can do our part in helping you promote it and you can tell are us you, what we need to do. Are you going to need the case to store your candies? I don't know. You can store them. Oh, well, I don't know how busy we'll be now. <laughs> Maybe we won't because have you're welcome. The first year you're I welcome. store them all in my house. Oh, my God. You're welcome. To, uh, there was lots at the case last year. Yeah. Imagine Holy that. Shmoly, yeah. 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 And we're open as you're well. More so. yeah, you're more than welcome. Yeah, you You're more than welcome. Yeah. You know, you know what might be a good idea is a uh, role in a store. If yeah. he was to sell candy and, and somebody could buy a box of candy that's going to be donated, right? So it's like a box of chocolate bars or whatever. And they it's just one of those like, hey, do you want to support the the Bonfield Halloween? It's easy with the opportunity too. Like people who are like, forgot to get candy. Absolutely. Now, there, if you're in the store. Just give you're... Cash and you got the candy? It, yeah. That whatever too. was yeah. easiest for oh, people. Okay. Like if you wanted to give me money, I went like yes. once a week. Yeah. But somebody adding eight bucks onto yeah. their bill yeah. just to buy a yeah. box of candy is really yeah. like almost mm -hmm. a no-brainer. I bet you would do Walmart something like that. Well, it was easier for people, yeah. except I mean, for I mean, people were still giving me cash donations back, right? at like four o'clock Halloween day. Anyway, so, so I would go to the quick way and buy like a hundred dollars worth of little airheads and stuff because it was like. Yeah, Actually, I can accept be candy donations the day of, it. but well, I can't. His yeah, you gotta put it in the flyer. You gotta put it in the flyer. Yeah, but it's just, just getting given over there. But you know, you're gonna have to come out if if it keeps coming. But I don't know that. Yeah, you don't know till the last minute. There's literally no way of knowing. Like last year, we had tons and tons and tons of candy. Well, I think Richard always did too, didn't he? Yeah. He always had overage. I don't think they ever went under. But there was also tons of kids last year. And that's another hard thing, because even if you drive the street before you go, just to get a rough idea of like how many kids there are, yeah. by the time you get to the <laughs> end, like there's so many more kids. But you're getting kids from from the surrounding from area. <laughs> yeah. It's great. I, I it. think it's The more just, the merrier. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Did you not yeah. send a letter last year in regards to donating candies or funds? Because we gave yeah. money. Yeah. Like, I mm -hmm. hate shopping. Yeah. So I think <laughs> we dropped off candy at the case, right? Yeah. You guys were collecting. Yeah. 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 Lots of people liked being able to just give cash or like e-transfer to mm -hmm. like, and yeah. I just had a separate account with my banking yeah. that had all of the candy money. That's really smart. So yeah. it worked out really well. Okay. People are super yeah. generous to like. Oh, yeah. Like when are you sending of, out your letter again? That you did last year, probably August, like the okay. beginning of August. Do, do I do sponsors like I did last year? You can if you want, because that got a lot of businesses really into it, and yeah. then yeah. most of those yeah. businesses also wanted to do floats as do exactly what you did last them. year because it was perfect. Okay, last year same thing, but six o'clock. You're in charge. Smaller roof. <laughs> yeah. Right. And you just let us know what you need. Are you yeah. sure you're gonna need a smaller roof though? <laughs> If everyone else, I heard about in South River. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's a big thing. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yep. For me, the route was fine because I feel like it incorporated everyone. But for the people in, like when you're stuck in a float in a parade driving two miles an hour down a street, it feels like it feels probably forever. like forever. But you know what? Yeah. They enjoyed it. My yeah. mom had everybody a cooler on her float. Everybody <laughs> had <laughs> Everybody <laughs> Everybody yeah. had smiles on their the face. Yeah. No, it was fine. It was perfect. Yeah. 
And the yeah. kids had to have been satisfied, Renee, yeah. because I only had one kid come to my door. <laughs> and that was from across the street. Nice. <laughs> See, my parents, they always lived on development, so they never got trick-or-treaters. Yeah. Ever, In the ever, 20 years I, I had, too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so, and they love Halloween. Mm -hmm. So A when, great I first, job. when I first moved out of my parents' house, I moved on to Church Street. And my dad every year was like, we're doing a haunted house. Like, <laughs> and he would go and buy every Halloween decoration. He'd go the next day and get them all on sale for the next day. Like it was a big thing. So yeah. I'm glad that he still has an outlet for his yes. Halloween addiction. Yes. <laughs> yes. Good. Okay. All right. Awesome. Santa up. parade. We need to set a date. Santa. Then we can... Uh, First weekend, weekend of right? December? October 31st with costumes. That's Santa <laughs> <laughs> He's in the back. Are you doing yeah, it on the weekend? Time? The parade so starts at lights. four. Um, and the reason it, four o'clock is dark. Um, it starts to get dark. It starts to get dark. Uh, and the reason why we do it at four is so that by the time we end up at the, the hall, it's closer to five because we have free chili. Okay. And we have soup and contest. Uh, soup, a soup, soup and chili tasting contest. Okay. You could get in on that with your. Crew. They do. We do. They do. Yeah. That, that's something we so do. So, yeah. about when you're advertising, you're also advertising for that. Well, what they um, what they do is they they make chili and uh, soup. We enter. Yeah. yeah. They enter. And oh. then, uh... <laughs> okay. So have you won? We did. Yeah, there you go. We did. I had that on there. She did too. I did too. Yes. She just stay that on there. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. It's all fixed. <laughs> Rigged. <laughs> so we, uh, uh, some of our, just for the two of you haven't been here since uh, we do soup and chili. So anyone in the community can enter either a soup or chili, and then we set them up and people taste. They vote. But we also have a great big pot of chili uh, that people can actually sit there and have a meal with uh, buns and whatever. Um, the last year we had music. Mm -hmm. uh, JR played music. Mm -hmm. We have all kinds of crafts for the kids to do. We have cookie decorating. Um, yeah. and, <laughs> and usually by <laughs> six o'clock, like it goes four to six, six thirty. Once everybody's um, had their chili and whatever, then they kind of go back home and. Uh, yeah. So that's the Santa Claus. Thing. Okay. No, no, he's on the parade, but Santa Claus uh, is always uh, in a rush to go to another event. Oh, gotcha. So, Busy day. yeah, because <laughs> he does do a breakfast with Santa. Uh, so refuse. ours just arrives yeah. to town as the other yeah. ones. Mm -hmm. they Was actually... there a date on that? I missed it. No, we, uh, that's what I was asking. Usually it's the first weekend of December. And that the would third. Be... December 3rd? Yeah. That's a Saturday, the first one. Okay. Great. There you go. And our parade uh, usually leaves from here to finish at the hall. The hall. So it just yeah. goes up the road, up Church Street, because at that time um, it may be a little bit cold. And uh, we usually have some horses, so we don't want them going too far. So they just What's come up here. Parade? Pardon? What's Four o'clock. Four. Yeah. four till six is the thing. Usually about yeah. four to six. Yeah. I think that the, the parade left at four, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because don't drive fast. No. Like that. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's people in the back. You don't want to fall it off. <laughs> <laughs> what is, do you think? Okay. Yeah. What? Never mind. It doesn't make sense. Okay. You had mentioned with the summer camp that not to be in anybody's business but there could potentially be families who may not be able to afford some things mm -hmm. do you think you could incorporate like a toy drive into this and then the first weekend of december it gives three weeks before christmas and people can come they can drop off some toys and then parents can apply if they could use a car we usually do, um, we didn't do a toy drive. We did uh, fill a cruiser. Okay. So we had uh, an OPP vehicle and people could donate. Uh, they would just put it into the cruiser. And then when uh, he got to the hall, uh, somebody from the uh, Family Life Center food bank would come and meet okay. the OPP officer. And then all of the supplies went into the food bank and that went for the Christmas baskets. Okay. But we can also do Christmas eh? telethon. Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. But we could also do a, a toy drive at the same time. Well, to, I, no. I think if we're going to do that, we should probably collect and give to one of the Santa, like Lippy, the Santa needs help or whatever. Family supply all the time from Bonfield as yep. well to it. Mm-hmm. So yeah. It is, and I used to be the board chair of Lippy. It is an administrative nightmare to try and run a, a toy drive. Like yeah. the drive itself is easy. It's the distribution of the stuff after, because then you're trying to fill voids, and you're because now you need money to buy for different age groups that you didn't get gifts for, and it becomes pretty. Okay, so just heavy. the food drive, fill a cruiser yeah, would be yeah, something like that. And or if it's going to be toys, then we just pick a charity, then we give all the toys to, and they distribute. So yeah. Salvation Army or one of them. Yeah. yeah. I just yeah. don't think we have the capacity to really do the toy distribution. Does, uh, do you know if the lions uh, give out toys with their baskets? So, so maybe perfect. we could speak to the Absolutely. lions yeah. Love it. Um, yeah. and see. Because we do our Christmas telethon and then we do from the Christmas telethon, we go buy our toys, we go buy our groceries. So if we did a toy drive the baskets, and a fill a and cruiser. And we have a list of names of families that yeah. need it and we get uh, Denise Raymond from mm-hmm. the food bank that helps us with that and uh, like last year I think we did 30 baskets and then we have the age groups so we buy the toys from the oh, Christmas yeah, telethon yeah. for that age group mm-hmm. and every child has one or two gifts so that would be that toy drive would be beneficial to give to the Lions Club, then the kids would have a little bit yeah. more than. And I think if we can do it, you try and advertise ahead of time which yeah. groups you're looking for. Or if not, you end up with a bunch of teddy bears and uh, kid drum sets, like baby drum sets, yeah. right? Because that's, love... they go and they buy that because it's cute. Well, uh, you know, how I many could, um, I could, I could um, contact Carol Burge uh, because her and her husband are the ones that are in the, the chair for the, mm-hmm. the Christmas telethon of the Lions. And uh, she would be able to tell me the age groups, and then I can bring it yeah. back. To, uh, like if it's eight to ten year old boys and yeah. uh, whatever, right? Yeah. So. And it's awesome with Treasure Hunt too, because you can get so many really great things, way, way, way affordable. Mm-hmm. Like I would be happy to buy quite a few different toys and toys for for that. Mm-hmm. Because the idea that a kid may not get a toy on Christmas. Because I think we gave out 30 baskets last year. If that's I'm incredible. Not mistaken. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's really awesome. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We, we always knit mitts and stuff too. Yep. And, and that. So they're, yeah, they're that still goes going in their in? baskets. Okay. Yeah. Okay. See, that yeah. would be another thing that you yeah. do on a we Wednesday do, we night. Do that. Yeah. Yeah. But with people that are maybe not 45 to learn how to knit, learn how to crochet. I was going, to, that was something I was going to say. Do you My think that learn how? would would fly you know young kids used to learn in school yeah okay not my age group you don't even learn school stuff in school Uh, no i know there's nothing (laughs) you can't you You can't make people do anything anymore but we we don't mind trying to teach a small group to bake or a small group to knit we can't handle you know large groups especially for knitting you know, that's like I said, if you're if you're looking for a new generation to come in and take yeah. over the picnic, then they need to learn how to how to make the pies, how to make the sea pie. So you could do yeah. a night out of the week where you're just showing people how to cook. Everyone gets to enjoy yeah. the pie. You could bring some pie to your Friday night cards and pool game. Yeah. You could do a night that's knitting. People can donate the stuff that oh, they so made. Yeah. They can go to the toy yeah. drive. Yeah. And then you're bringing in a whole new age group of people so you're teaching them a skill which is fun for them because it's like a class you can go with yes. kids so, and, so then the and then give them to somebody you know what I mean the only thing is is that the, the that one part. thing about yeah. golden age is that, okay we've <laughs> yeah. done all this work all these years now so we want to learn over at my house yeah. and like, but you can't do this until you train someone to take a good place my wife can watch that I don't know I don't know where it is Okay, I, I, I okay we'll move on to time. the next. Uh, you know, and, and see what they say. That's it but for that? I've, I've, my group right for now, age plan. numbers about 10. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay. So we're not large. 7.2. Yeah. Business promotion trade show. We be- spoke about this a bit for the, at the last meeting. Yeah. Do we want to move that on to I, I, the I'm, next? My personal opinion is maybe we should uh, do this either. Hmm. There's so many activities. 
Yeah. I would say early spring, so we have time to organize it okay. and to have Sabrina come in, and uh, because she's part of development, right? That's part of her her um, job description. And because uh, it's really too soon right now, but still see the messages on Facebook. Does anybody know who mm -hmm. does this or that? And I think it's really important for us to do this. What do you think? From businesses. businesses. Oh, okay. Because there's local businesses here that we don't that, know who they are, uh, where I they are. I did a <laughs> sponsor page about them last year. I know all the businesses, in <laughs> but that, but even the ones that work out of home, so that you know, some of them do herbals, some of them do, and that's their their business. So, so that's a fair point. I think. I wonder how we, if we can get something electronically started, like it's a home that all yeah. of these places get to actually just put their services and list their services. So that like it's bond field services or whatever it is, like it could be a subsection of our website or something because we don't have a chance. Well, we or... do have um, information on our website and we do put it in the welcome package. However, um, you can do like, a well, it, it, it is, pages. it's like, it's, it's not that it's outdated. It's not current. It's not updated. Like, yeah. yeah. And we don't, we don't have a way of knowing. Uh, and I think the best place is in the rink. Especially now that we have the uh, curtain there, because that's the biggest place. The hall's not big enough because there's quite a few businesses. Yes, and that's the thing is we need to have those businesses to tell us that they they're here, so we can add them to our business directory. How can we how can we get in touch with the businesses that we don't know exist in Bonfield? I send a flyer. Send a. I'll get another copy of the sponsor sheet that I did last year because there's mm -hmm. quite a few on there. And I don't know if you want to reach out to everyone individually. Like I have all the numbers and everything on the mm -hmm. sheet. Or you can just post on like the Facebook page or something and say like on this date, we are going to be updating a portion of our website to include information from all the local businesses. If you would like to have us advertise your business and have all of your information like at a click of a button because mm -hmm. you see people posting all the time does anyone know anybody yeah here yeah a seamstress yeah. Uh, blah, 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 yeah. Blah. yeah yeah so if they could just go into a category like i have that on my like mom pages on facebook if i'm looking for a cake decorator i just go on the cake decorator album and i have everybody who makes cakes in north bay has their own little picture in this thing i go through i find the one I want, message the person. So the sponsorships that you have, Renee, is that all Bonfield yep. or is it surrounding areas? I'm pretty sure it's all like strictly Bonfield. Okay. Maybe the exception of one or two like bigger companies. That list would be a good starting point for mm -hmm. us. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. That's and great. we can like, give it to Sabrina and like you say, like we got a lot of stuff going early on early spring. Yeah. yeah, we got a lot of stuff going from here on. to the end yeah. of the year. It's because we have to figure out if we're going to promote Pass. services as well. Because not every service mm -hmm. is, a, is a exactly. registered business, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah, we have to figure out where's our Both. line, right? Like I would like to think we would, but mm -hmm. I don't know what kind of legal trouble we get into and that's promoting somebody who's yeah. running a business without being a registered business but i guess there's a yeah. threshold right for mm -hmm. and it depends yeah. like we where we're coming out as a recreation and fitness or do we have a committee just for business well that's yeah. would be sabrina i mean economic development i mean we're into yeah. economic but we development can work, but we can work, yeah. pretty much yeah. no, we can work together Nothing stops so. us from yeah. working together yeah. yeah that's how we get things done right so. <laughs> by promoting the business we can get yep. for our yeah <laughs> okay, so i'll keep that on the uh, unfinished business and uh we right. can continue discussing okay. it new year's dance isn't on us no it's on we have enough for tonight <laughs> it's coming up though. Right. It's coming up it's coming up yes okay discussions 7.3 paddle boat update so you all have the yeah. correspondence yep They do. You guys don't. Okay. I'm like, that's a discussion. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. So
so the paddle boat was returned? No, it hasn't been. That's my recommendation that we return it. Oh, because of liability? There's right? way too yeah. much work involved. Um, okay. I think so too. You can go to your place and yeah. not on my leg. <laughs> I uh, I wish we could make it work, but I uh, mm -hmm. the liability is huge. Yeah, yeah. So I think just... and to have policies in place, yeah. and yeah, yeah, you would yeah. basically have to hire somebody. Who's inspecting it? Who's... Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful idea, but I don't think it's. Going you have to, to have a bunk yeah, there with someone there that is supervising, taking the boat out and bring it back in, and anyways. But yeah. it can be reviewed later. It on. can be. Can, it can be, be brought thank up you for again. your donation. Um, we can make arrangements for Ask it to Camp uh, Caratu. Well, there are uh, beaches super far from yeah. the village. <laughs> <laughs> like, I down. drove kayaks down to that beach. I didn't walk. Like that. I didn't okay. walk. Okay. Yeah. All right. So. Okay, Lisa, 7.4, moving night. moving apart. So what I did, <laughs> I only did seven of these. Right. There's only five. It's all right. So uh, let me just count them over here. And there's one for you, and then maybe you still can just share one. Okay. But not a one right and I did this because I, I felt that some of you may not know when I was um, on a Zoom meeting in June, uh, what I was talking about. <clears throat> oh, yeah. So we do have a stage area that you can see on the, the top left picture. Mm -hmm. And then um, in, the, in the middle on the top, um, it shows where the pull down screen is. And um, Rusty was there and I pointed yeah. out to you and it, it's... It's a pretty decent location. Yep. We don't have to worry about weather that way yep. or any of those types of uh -huh. things. Um, and then the picture to the right, I have two propane fire pits there. Um, now, I did just do a little birthday party. So I had our little fencing around the propane. If anybody knows about living in a liability world, it's me. <laughs> mm -hmm. I bet. It, um, yeah, it sucks a lot of the fun out of the things that we used to do as kids, but, but um, mm -hmm. that's just the way it is anymore. And then the, the picture on the bottom left, I kind of, I just went back out into like the parking area to kind of show that, that fenced area. My, I don't know, I guess I'm running out of toner or something too. I don't know, but um, it, you can kind of see the fenced area. Mm -hmm. And yeah. um, too long here. that is... Um, we're yeah. we're um, our capacity in there is for 300 people and there are picnic tables and as you know picnic tables can be moved we can configure them into any uh way shape or form or if we want to say no we're not going to give anybody picnic tables everybody has to bring their lawn chairs i'm fine with whatever is decided and it also shows that i have um a tent down along this side mm -hmm. and i put picnic tables in there too because my daughter's a ginger and we don't do sunshine. I'm allergic to the sun. I'll be right there with you. <laughs> she, she needs to have shelter. So yeah. um, <coughs> uh, then um, the last picture the, on the bottom right shows uh, the food truck and it's kind of around. And that's the uh, that's the bathrooms there, the washrooms there, um, the men's and ladies um, facilities are there. Too. So it's all very, yeah, very close to the awesome, really. to that area. Um, I have a popcorn machine. I'm getting another one, so there'll be so there'll be that too. Um, I think on on the agenda there was something about movies, right? You want to mm -hmm. talk about movies? The discussion. Yeah. We we have the date. Um, we we had discussed at the last meeting maybe doing a corn roast. A scary movie would be cool. Um, uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> so are, movie are we the going to just the do the, the movie and the kids? <laughs> 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 yeah, I thought that the corn roast after a movie girl, though. This is for kids and we're not in corn. It's yeah. going to be a mess. Yeah, I yeah. Know. yeah. Popcorn's yeah. enough, uh, yeah. I, I think, to begin with. And yeah. um, the activities, I, you know, 
make it a pajama night, a big, big pajama party. Yeah. I think so we just fun. do a movie night, yeah. movie in the park. We have uh, a child children's movie, and then we do an adult movie. Yeah. And you would have popcorn in the canteen open, so we don't have to worry about uh, supper or anything like that. Right. Um, I can have inflatables if we... No. Okay. No. Liability. 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 Yeah. <laughs> We're sorry. It's no. Nope, no. Nope. Unless the township wants to pay for the insurance for them, it's okay. No. Nope. Actually, very hard to get. It's insurance just we have a deposit uh, that we can use at any time. So oh, if okay. we have an activity, well, but no. Okay. So it is a. So we'll have to. Uh, what did we say? August thirteenth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I mean, just the thought of going to an outdoor movie. That's enough. Right? Yeah, I mean. Like, what kind of other activities do you need? Like, yeah. the kids are just going to be yeah. Yeah. Especially okay. if you have the latest cartoon movie, Disney movie. I also have um, Paul Silent Motors actually donated to me these. They're um, battery-operated small Denali car uh, trucks. And oh, it's, yeah. I don't know how old. This high old, <laughs> five, <laughs> six, uh, up to that age. Uh, we have a grass area that they can drive them around on. Those are covered under my insurance, so that would be that would be. So, like um, uh, my grandson, it. we have a gator. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we have just, a half a dozen of them. So yeah. That so they could be, play with that if uh, they're not really interested in watching the movie. Right, but they would have to go with like to down to the grass yeah. area or something they want to distract the other kids i think we just make it a, like i think that's great like the, but, but i think, I think just, it, the, just movie. the movie night i think we try and water it down too much i think yeah. we're losing I like it, let's just make it a oh, we, we can't have too much because yeah. then you're going to have people yeah, all over the place and i think it's a movie and, and i do think that i think that families should feel more than welcome to bring their own snacks and their own drinks mm -hmm. and Absolutely. their own stuff mm -hmm. Uh, only because there's so many dietary restrictions yeah. and things now that um, is it gluten free? Mm -hmm. No, I don't think and so. And I, I think that know. it would be just uh, yeah, easier. But the canteen will be available, right? It will and be then, available, but I, I don't, I don't want, um, I don't want it so that you can't bring your own bag of jujubes or whatever yeah. it is that's your thing. But, but if we say anyway. bring your own snacks, canteen. Uh, will mm -hmm. be open. Uh, popcorn. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Um, What's a good start time? If like you're doing one later for the parents, think about how much time does it take. A movie's home, an hour and a give half. Give the kids a bath. Get them in bed. Get the sitter over. <laughs> well, no, the kids. Oh, it's one in, right after the oh, other. The kids call right the vehicle. There, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. This like is the drive is right. <laughs> <laughs> Go to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> or leave them with grandma. My kids, kids these days don't sleep. do that. No, my kids <laughs> no. don't sleep. They, they're yeah, they're up later than we are. Yeah, yeah. If my kids fall asleep in the truck, I'm screwed because they're not going back to bed. Like, <laughs> so, the, like, the, the adult way. movie doesn't have to be like scary for kids or anything. Like, it, yeah. one can be a could cartoon be a and one doesn't. Movie. Yeah, it can still yeah, be just like make a, it a family movie. I think that's, I feel that is the way to go. I don't think that. No scary or nothing. Because, I mean, you got to remember that there's some of the the kids are going to be, you know, yeah. 12, 14 years old as yeah. well. So, yeah. you know, we don't want them yeah. to be the new Elvis movie. One, uh, <laughs> one kid, bring them in. Disney movie and one family movie. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's too bad they're not doing something? like a Oh, they are well, like a remake of an old movie. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like they're coming out with like a new Hocus Pocus. I'm not telling you. <laughs> I'm just saying, like a remake of an old movie yeah. that would get Holy like, single focus. the younger generation excited because it's a new exciting movie, but mm -hmm. the older generation excited because yeah. it's a spin off of what they're yeah. familiar with. Like a new old. The young. time is going to be. And this is what free, time? right? Well, that's the How time. How dark is going to be before you can see it? Really, is good. this free to the to the people in the? And where does the sunset? Is the sun going to be setting behind you? So it's going the sun sets over there. So the stage. So where's your screen? Like in your... Yeah, but it's under. Uh, it's it's under, under. Yeah. So it would. Uh... It's darker there. So I'm just trying to see. Okay, it's going to be covered. So it's, it's dark there. It's free, really? Yeah. Um, You're going to be. Because uh, maybe two hours ish. I'm going to get there at three. Yeah, it's going to be dark. <laughs> I'd like to say that the park would be open at five and the movie start at six. Okay. But I can. Am I there tomorrow? 
I think I'm there tomorrow, so I can take a look at six o'clock and see what the because by August it's going to be darker than what yeah, it is yeah. tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, I'll know by then, and then uh, <laughs> as far as promotion goes, I can put it on my stuff, but I. I'm old and uncool. I really like your printed newsletter. Yeah. I love getting it. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. I read it. Yeah. It's front to back a couple times. Like, um, I really think that there's a lot of people that do. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's not, a lot that it's not a bell I'll read it. One of my biggest yeah. <laughs> problems for my business and my life up here is internet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a big problem. I can't upload, download. Anyways, Andrea, you say that a lot of people don't, but the people that do yes. spread the word. Yes. Yeah. And so, that's where we have to get them to. Yeah. Um, I think more people read it than you think. I just think that they disregard it out there. Like read it. Oh, nothing. I'm interested. You know, but that I, too. I think they still um, but yeah. this, this is so exciting. That's this what I mean. Like thing, thing, if oh they get God. one that that's like like full of stuff that, that they're that excited the about. There. They're reading it. They're keeping that it. They're making the copies trucks. and making sure they're. Yeah, I believe it is. You know? I've been so talking it's... to people from quite a bit yeah. about yeah. because I knew I heard that it was coming, and the, the yeah, first thing they say is where, where. I, I don't know. I don't. I, I don't know where they're doing it. You know, it doesn't matter. This is exciting. Yeah, I like I like the the classic. I'll ask Andre about the, mm -hmm. the board out there, Andre. Pardon? The board at the Rose. The Lions. Yeah, we can ask the Lions to put it there. There's a lot of fun things. Even if it's just for the kids, even like something fun. Something kids love meetings, and it's not child like that. That board is honestly probably one of the best things I've ever So if yeah, something I could bring my kids, I don't have that time. All of their energy out right before bed. So if I did a flyer and I put the soccer on there, the date night, the movie night, and then I would need something else coming up soon that would be How and then to, to, um yeah is that mm -hmm. soon enough let's put it right at the bottom like, like yeah oh yeah. yeah halloween yeah i can do the last page with um a couple of things um like what to look for coming yeah, event. coming look, soon coming, coming soon. event yes yeah soccer. halloween uh the Christmas. soccer the soccer halloween night. well yeah. no the soccer will have its own page we'll do date night <laughs> can movie our night is are going there sure well, in the coming Lisa? soon, yeah, yeah. If there's anything yeah. that we can do to help you with that event, yeah. could you let me know? Uh, I just think some if we could get it on this sign out here, yeah, yeah, uh, that's that's pretty high viz there, yeah. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I Pardon? think that's uh, um, sorry, I know, okay. no, that's okay. I, <laughs> I'm uh, <laughs> back to my energy, you're not so, yeah, <laughs> you're <laughs> you're <laughs> As long as you I've tried everything, everything that's page. available and it's not uh, not any better. One point three for upload and one point one yeah, two down right now. Neither mm. one. <laughs> when you come from the city and you get here, it's like yeah. I have been so lucky where I am. Yeah. I have eighteen Ooh, down. Then. Like I don't okay. like what do you have? What do you have? It's, it's on top of the hill. Yeah, I'm, I'm on top of the hill, and I, um, it's a company. It's actually it's ultimately Bell, but I pay seventy dollars a month for unlimited down from a company called I had Bell Starlink. Yeah, nope, cool. it's um. That's I'm with Virgin, and it's uh, really what is the name? Yeah, Virgin. It's really yeah. up here. Yeah. The only yeah. thing that's Thunder available Bell. at the park yeah. is ExploreNet. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And that's just one step above smoke signals. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> that's, that's good. did we come up on a movie? August 13th. Take your uh, yeah, two minions. minions. Minions? Well, I think there's two minion yeah. movies, but I'll see which one. Yeah, I think there's one that one. just come out. Yeah. It might be yeah, yeah, there is a new one, but I don't think it's get it money yet. if it's new. Yeah, just come up. Grandkids just went oh, see it. I'll have to look into <laughs> just, it. Just but but if they're running in the theaters, probably it's not. Well, you can actually because you you just if you you're so can member, you you can access oh, all those oh, things. Oh, okay. Are balloons a liability? Like balloons on string? Well, that well depends if the latex, if there's latex allergies. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> ah, <laughs> Guilty. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. And we're going to do another movie after? Yes. Um, any? Take a class. It's a favorite class. 
Oh, you don't want to know. <laughs> yeah, we do. Well, I, I'm, I'm big fan of like Top Gun and. Um, oh yeah. You, you, know, you would have to. Original Top Gun. Yeah. The timing is great. Oh, that. Yeah. The original. Oh, the timing is great for that with the new, the we second should, one coming out. Yeah, if we're gonna do something old, we should do Days of Thunder for the track. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Days yeah. of Thunder. Days nice. of Thunder is good. Yeah. Loud, awesome. It's race cars, of course it is. Yeah, tiny track. I am. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. Thunder. Yeah. Is that the Tom Cruise one? Yeah. 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 I think well, that's a really good idea. Yeah, Ricky Bobby. Bobby. So, no, yeah. I like Ricky Bobby. <laughs> okay, I'll get those ones. Okay, so Days of Thunder cool. and uh -huh. Minions. And maybe you should do Cars for uh, the kids actually, movie. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, would that be? Yeah. That's that is actually because then it's kind of fun. It's it? themed yeah. to the. Yeah. Movie. Yeah. Theme to the park. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, good. Great idea. Yeah. Thank uh, you. At least for like the first movie. Right? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Cars and uh, Days of Thunder. Okay, we have to settle so that we can promote those things. Cars. Okay, Cars and Days of Thunder. Yeah. Cars. So okay. Cars will we'll say is at six o'clock. Okay. Because that what's yeah. movie usually like hour and a half to two hours. An hour and, and a half. And then yeah. we yeah. do Days of Thunder at eight o'clock. Are you going to have a pee break and make a motion? They can pee anytime. No, no, I'm ready. When, when, you know, when, when you used to go to the yeah. drive-in, when you used to go to the drive-in, pee break, you, you, you leave the car and yes. go. Yeah. yeah. Like the 30 so walk to the yeah. I, I can't hold it to a whole movie. I think longer. It's probably not going to be dark enough at 6 in August. No, I'll take a look at it. We we have stuff playing all day. Yeah. On, on stage. And you can so, see it. Yeah. So you must have I'll a really a good projector. Yeah. 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 That's fair. Yeah. Because you can play in bright and sunshine. Because yeah, so, yeah, it's going to get dark till like almost close to seven. Right? So mm -hmm. if you can send me what Carol's to put on the Lions billboard, yep. the so that I can send can... an email directly to Carol there you too. Go. There you go. And are we? Is the setup going to be people with lawn chairs kind of in that? front area in where you see on the bottom left kind of that front yes. and all be lawn chairs and then everything kind of passed or this side of the fence is like cars is yes parking. after that after the grout um after the the pavement on that yeah. part I, that's our one of our emergency access roads so sure, if road, um yeah. i have to have we have to have ambulance mm -hmm, or something mm -hmm. come in i have to have that road clear yep. so on this side is where we'd have cars to to sit mm -hmm. up in there and we do have the FM transmitter that the it'll be broadcast, so you can listen to it in your car. But we also have speakers that'll be out on the stage to that you can hear it in that area. So that have Amazing. Have okay, so bring your lawn chairs. Yeah. Or and or bug that. repellent. It would be cool if when you're they did. Well, no, don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody will come. Yeah, yeah. Like a drive-in theater with the yeah. cars and showed like a black and white. Nineteen fifties, like. The the full experience, you know. I think that no, I, I went to drive in, so there's no black and white, it was all color. Was it? Uh, I'm so we're just 26. gonna prepare a plane, plane, uh, plane flyer <laughs> and just whatever, keep it simple. Okay. Okay. Whatever, I, I, started started I might have been here, I was just waiting. Um, <laughs> no, he didn't think it. he's like, I wasn't gonna say it, but <laughs> the date, the time, the movies, the That's... free. Yeah, bring, bring yeah. your own lawn chairs bring or your lawn sit chairs. in your vehicle like the old yeah. days. Yeah, so have back to up your truck on the flyer. So you... Yeah, yeah, I know. Back it's in the back of the truck. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and bring your sleeping bags yeah. for the little yeah. kids to fall asleep in. Yeah. 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 By the way, it was so great having all the bikes in town last weekend. Yes, oh, was yeah. awesome. there was some beautiful yeah. bikes. Yeah. Yeah. There was oh, some that were there from some very world famous builders and wow. it was uh, there were some nice ones yeah, yeah. one very guy nice. had a good Incredible. stereo system on his <laughs> past my house but he was only playing music that i liked so <laughs> I <had a> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. no complaints yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Lisa. Yes, yes thank amazing. you. I'm excited. Yes. I feel like a kid. Yeah. yeah. I used to do stuff like this at Pearls all the time for the community. So I'm I'm like excited. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Well, it's thank you. Here now. <laughs> yeah. All right. That'd be great. Number eight, correspondence. Do you have anything? No. Mm -hmm. Information. Mm -hmm. Next meeting. TBD. Our next meeting should be um. August 8th, 
So do we want to keep that date just to make sure that we have everything planned? Everything ready and absolutely. Yeah, and on your day off to make sure everything's planned. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. On the side. On the side. On the side. Yeah, if you want, Andre, it's fine. August 8th at 7? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then we can last minute plans or whatever with anything on here or something Anything comes up. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay. All right. Perfect. I'm very disappointed that Halloween's on a Monday. Because <laughs> even Nancy wanted to do something with Halloween at the park. Like we could have done something okay. after the parade. Oh, okay. We were you talking did. about like, oh, maybe oh, moving to the park to do something. <laughs> like yeah. 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 You have to move in second. Something creepy yeah. there, but on a Monday, I don't think that would be too uh, <laughs> too late. Well, yeah. Six years from now, you'll be back so far. Well, is this the thing in home really? I just want to say something to all of you. Uh, I was on the rec committee before and I left and I'm back. I, I hope nobody will kick me out. But I have to say the positive attitude that's here now, it just, I'm breathing again. That's awesome. Thank you very, Good. very much. You're welcome. Right. So Thanks for coming here. back. Yeah. <laughs> yep. That's great. Oh, I can't. All right, moved by Lee, second by Jessica. The Can Recreation move, Business Committee meeting be adjourned at 8.36 p.m. All in favor? <laughs> Carry. <laughs> Done. Great. What's in there? I'm getting my kids in playing soccer. I'm a nurse. I know better. <laughs> <laughs>